Hey there, welcome to our video about the different parts of a car's exterior. Cars are these amazing machines we use for getting around. But have you ever wondered what makes up the outside of a car and what these spots do? Well, today, we're going to explore just that. Let's dive right in. First, we have the outer body shell. Think of this as the car's skeleton. It holds everything together, from the engine to the seats, and even you. It's designed to support the weight of all the car's pots and passengers. Next, we have the hood or bonnet. You know that metal cover at the front? That's the hood or bonnet in some places. It protects the engine, battery, and more. It's like a shield for your car's vital organs. Moving on, we have the front bumper. This is the hero that takes the hit when there's a minor collision. It keeps you, your car, and passengers safe by absorbing the impact. Then, there's the bumper grill. It's not just for looks. This grill helps cool the engine by letting in air. Imagine it as your car's breathing system. Next up is the rear bumper, like the front bumper, but at the back. It's there to save the day when you accidentally reverse into something. Moving forward, we have the headlights. Those bright lights at the front, they help you see at night and let others know you're coming. There are different types for different situations. Then there are indicator lights. These lights signal your intentions to other drivers, like when you're turning or changing lanes. Using them at the right time is like speaking a universal language on the road. And there are fog lights. When things get misty, these lights cut through the fog to help you see better. There are front and rear fog lights. Let's not forget the radiator and radiator support. The radiator keeps your engine from overheating by cooling the coolant. The support system keeps it all in place. Next on the list are wiper blades. These are like magic brooms that sweep away rain and dart from your windshield so you can see clearly. Now, we have the cow panel. It's like a shield between your hood and windshield, keeping debris out of the wiper system. Continuing, there's the quarter panel. These are the side panels that wrap around the wheels, adding style and protection. Moving higher, we have the roof of car. It's the umbrella for your car, protecting you from the elements. And there's also the sunroof of car, a window to the sky. It lets in light and fresh air, but it comes with a cost and needs some DLC. Now, let's talk about fender and fender lineup. Fenders protect your car's sides and look good doing it. Fender liners keep road debris from flying. Then, we have the mirrors. Side view mirrors help you see beside your car, while the rear view mirror watches your back. Moving on, we have the doors of car. These are your entrances and exits. They can be manual or powered, depending on your car. Don't forget the door handle, the magic key to your car. It's not just a handle, it contains the lock too. Next, we have window glass. These see-through panels let you enjoy the view and keep the elements out. Now, let's discuss deck lids or trunk. It's not just for luggage, it's for storing things. Just remember, the more you load, the more fuel you'll use. Then, there are wheels and hubcaps. Wheels are where the rubber meets the road, and hubcaps cover the wheels center to keep them clean and stylish. Now, let's take a look at the dashboard, your car's command center, displaying all the vital info you need while driving. Lastly, there's the number plate. It's not just for looks. It's a legal requirement that gives your car its own identity. So there you have it, the many pots that make up the exterior of your car. Each one plays a crucial role in keeping you safe and your car running smoothly. Take good care of them, and your car will take care of you. Thanks for watching, and drive safely.